Joey demo. I think I'm up to take five. Ooh, take five. <laughs> That's a good song. <clears throat> okay. Born in Red Hook, Brooklyn, in the year of God knows when. Opened up his eyes to the tune of an accordion. Always on the outside of whatever side there was. When they asked him why it had to be that way, well, he answered just because. Larry was the oldest. Joey was next to last They called Joe crazy The baby they called Kid Blast Some say they lived off gambling And running numbers too Always seen they got caught between the mob and the men in blue They killed their rivals, but the truth was far from that. No one ever knew for sure where they were really at. When they tried to strangle Larry, Joey almost hit the roof. He went out that night to seek revenge, thinking he was bulletproof. War broke out at the break of dawn And it emptied out the streets Joey and his brothers Suffered terrible defeats Till they ventured out behind the lines And took by prisoners They stashed them away in a basement Called them amateurs The hostages were trembling when they heard a man exclaim Let's blow this place to kingdom come Let Conrad take the blame But Joey stepped up, he raised his hand Said we're not those kind of men It's peace and quiet that we need To go back to work again Child of clay, Joey, Joey, what made them want to come and blow you away? The police department handled. Mr. Smith. They got him on conspiracy. They were never sure who with. What time is it, said the judge, to Joey when they met? Five to ten, said Joey. The judge says that's exactly what you get. He did ten years in Attica, reading Nietzsche and Wilhelm Wright. They threw him in the hole one time for trying to stop a strike. His closest friends were black men, cause they seemed to understand what it's like to be in society with a shackle on your hand. When they let him out in 71, well, he'd lost a little weight. 
but he dressed like Jimmy Cagney, and I swear he did look great. He tried to find a way back into the life he left behind. To the boss he said, I have returned, and now I want what's mine. Joey, Joey, king of the streets, child of clay. Joey, Joey, why did they have to come and blow you away? It was true in his later years, he would not carry a gun. I'm around too many children, he'd say, they should never know of one. Yet he walked right into the clubhouse of his lifelong deadly foe. Emptied out the register, said tell them it was Crazy Joe. One day they blew him down in a clam bar in New York. He could see it coming through the door as he lifted up his fork. He pushed the table over to protect his family. Then he staggered out into the streets of Little Italy. Joey. Joey, king of the streets, child of clay. Joey, Joey, what made them want to come and blow you away? Jacqueline and Carmela and Mother Mary all did weep. I heard his best friend Frankie say, he ain't dead, he's just asleep. Then I saw the old man's limousine head back towards the grave. I guess he had to say one last goodbye to the son that he could not save. The sun turned cold over President Street and the town of Brooklyn mourned. They said a mass in the old church near the house where he was born. And some day of God's in heaven overlooking his preserve. I know the man that shot him down will get what they deserve. Joey, Joey, king of the streets, child of clay. Joey, Joey, what made them want to come and blow you away? What made them want to come and blow you away?